Duplex 9010 all in one. Have a little look in the BIOS and see what it's got inside of it. And simple switch on. Remember into F2, so we go into the BIOS. Service tag system identifier for Dell for your support. And of course, here we've got memory. We're running with 4 gig of memory on here, running at 1600 megahertz. It's DDR3 SD RAM. And if we have a look at the bottom half of the page, you can see that we're running with an Intel Core i5. It's a 3475S. It's uh, running at 2.9 gigahertz. So you can see different specs on that. And then right down here, nice and simple, 500 gig hard drive, and of course the DVD that's inside it. We also know we've got the internal HD graphics and the Realtek audio controller for the sound. Now we're going to switch on and have a look at it going to Windows. We'll have a look in Windows at both Windows Experience and also we can look at the device manager and see what's inside also, along with what we've looked at in the BIOS. We've got a client system update for the Dell software that's installed. But at this moment in time, we're going to leave all of that there and leave that to the customer. Nice little simple looking device manager. <laughs> we just confirm everything that's inside. Here we are having a look inside the device manager list, just so we can see all of what's inside. As you can see, we've got the 500 gig hard drive, the internal graphics, the DVDs listed there, USB device inputs, we've got the SATA controller, we've got a webcam keyboard, the PCIe card reader, got the mouse and of course the generic monitor which is part of it. As you see the network adapter we're running with an 82579LM gigabit network connection. There's your processor, the i5-3475S, of course running at 2.9 gig quad core and we've got the standard compliant SD host controller here. As you can see the display audio and Realtek high definition audio listed here and then some simple bits and pieces on the system devices that are inside as you can see firmware hubs, fans and so forth and then right at the bottom a little list of the USB connections that are on it I'm just going to take a little look around the system of course you get the nice Dell simple keyboard and mouse included have the Optiplex 9010 all in one itself. Looking at this side of the system, as you can see, there's the DVD. And further down on the side, we've got the power button, the side key button, and the opener for the optical drive bay. Very, very nice. Very simple. Here we are having a look on the back, as you can see, we've got a power connector, a VGA connector. Next to that, we've got a line out and of course HDMI. Below that there's the network connection and here we're using two already and there are two above. And that's four USB 2 slots and of course two very lovely USB 3. And of course for those with old school peripherals, we've got two PS2 connectors for the keyboard and the mouse. Now we're just going to have a little look at the Windows experience and the rate the system. And here we are just having a little look at the Windows experience. 
and we've rated this system and as we can see processor absolutely fantastic memory is very good gaming graphic 3d graphics very good and hard drive very good the slightly slower is the desktop performance for windows aero but of course we're not too worried about that obviously that brings down the rating to a 5.3 but the rest of the scores fantastic 